January has gone, February has just started. This is MB02 2020 for the 1st of February, same year. Anyway, quarter five in the morning, it's blowy, but it's dry. And this is the first beer house of the year, which is good. Well, we're here, we as in me. So stay in there, that's the Sainsbury's uh, petrol station and that direction. And it's colder and pussy. Post Costa. I need to go. <coughs> okay, so there's lots of red here and there's tons of red at the bar because we are just across the border. And I need to get this one going. Anyway, this was 199 plus minus 50p because of the camera voucher. This is 10.50 by the Grain Store Brewery. 5% alcohol by volume. I thought it was Scottish, but it's brewed in Rutland. Home of the Ruttles. Or whatever. Anyway, nicely presented. Nice bit of carpet for Mr. Manning. Um, having us having breakfast. Mmm. That's sort of fruity, very fruity actually, rich, not particularly full bodied, fruity finish, that's B plus in a bit, that's not bad at all. Two minutes early, best to be early, avoid the rush. Clone Strange, going right to left, but there you go. So, this is, and it took ages to find, because I wasn't very good, um, <laughs> on tap, this is Fruited Sour, a Gypsy Hill, and um, Pig's Year, who I'd never should have before, but I have been informed, so, plus point there, 4.5% alcohol by volume. Sunny Mr. Cole. Ooh! Oh, I like that. Mildly sour, nicely fruity. Complex. Um, B plus plus in a bit. Yeah. Turning into dry February. This is really dry and fruity and wonderful and contains lactose. Um, I should tell you what it is. <laughs> Hard rolling. Uh, no S, no G, just impossibly 7% alcohol by volume, I'll be snoring. Um, siren and dry and bitter. Might be from Denmark. There you go. Anyway, um, I'm going to go A minus because it's a fruit bomb, but it's a dry fruit bomb. Yeah. Almost sunny. And you can just see the green light. We are charging. And we want to do everything. Gers. Old Gers. Underman's Curve Rene 2019. I think it's about 6%. It is. Yeah, I Yep, it is. Do you know what? I can do glass. Original I mean, we, we, we have to find a happy medium, don't we? Because you Smells like spunky. I remember we went to Montenegro for a week and we had, had a car because we were staying oh. together. And, um, <clears throat> and he wanted to get in the car and go somewhere every day. And it's I'm like, slightly no. different. No! <coughs> what do want? Oh, I ain't no sort of No, I know, but it's just, oh, no, see what's at the end of this road. Yeah. Why? She's yeah. Three point eight. I've got a lot of head. I'm going to have to be careful here because well, you know, untapped yeah. and toasty cake. Well, you well, I think you give it a one point two, so not keen. This is Don Clonch Clone. It's a local brilliant. Here, beer type, 4.8% alcohol by volume. Nicely yeah. presented. <laughs> and I like this. So. Let's start with the Sunny Mr. Cole. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Mm. Fruity and spicy. <gasps> Which is yeah. not what I'd associate. But the problem is this, you can't, you can't do it. Um, I'm gonna, yeah, and a spicy finish. I'm going to say a B plus. Three out of five. Nothing special. But different. <laughs> Come on, my nuts. This is from Bernie and Sky, who are usually excellent. Indecision time. 5.6% alcohol by volume. Simcoe and Sabro. Oh, so you're ready to try it? Yeah, sorry, but I usually have like German smoked beers, but I'm going to go back and still have had a few German beers. Oh, yeah. Does it smell like a fruit bomb? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Anyway, close. That is really good. A plus plus. Somewhat of a classic brewery. Colonel. <laughs> Beer to say so and so, cherry, 4.6% alcohol by volume, sedimented. Bottle conditioned, that means. Although, I'm not really sure, it doesn't look that way. Green means charging. Plus plus. Sour, tart, fruity. Rather nice. I'm croaky. <laughs> <laughs>